Top of the morning to you. Uh, huh? Uh, no, I'm not impersonating him. I'm I'm just drinking his coffee. I'm not an impersonator. I'm just a simp. Anyway, what's your favorite game developer? I'm straight into the small talk now. You might say Rockstar, you might say Valve, you know, whatever your favorite. My personal favorite is Peter. Hey, Peter. That's right, it used to be Burger King. So feckin' scary. So terrifying. I just, I love everything about it. But now that I've seen the art for this game, well, I am impressed. <laughs> They've already gone to the top of my list. I do want to play, but what, what is treasure? Oh, I haven't unlocked any. I guess we gotta put some Pokemon in chains before we can get our treasure. Generations of children were growing up believing that Pokemon exist for no other reasons than to be used and abused by humans. Children learned about dominance instead of compassion. I'm pretty sure Pokemon was like all about compassion actually. That is like the central theme from the little I remember of it. But uh, look, one Pokemon has had it off. <laughs> You've escaped from your trainer. Get ready to fight. I think a gentle breeze would knock my previous trainer out. Look at them. All right, do I want to uh, quick attack? Thunder shock or group hug? You know what? I think I'll go to group hug. <laughs> Yes, hug the meth addict. They keep throwing choke collars at me and I just continue to hug them over and over again to see what happens if I just lose. I'm dead. Is that it? Game over. <laughs> Shout out to Patreons, Anivish Kel, Abigail Alicia. Maybe I should actually try and attack the bastard. Thunder shock him. There we go, they're dead. Pikachu, instead of saying the usual Pika Pika, says Pokemon are not yours to abuse, Sharon. We exist for our own reasons, but this is what you are bred to do. Oh, come on. <laughs> Even you know what a weak argument that is. Well, maybe my other Pokemon doesn't want freedom. She's a well-behaved Pokemon. She likes to fight and remain caged up in her Pokeball all the time. If you believe that, give her the choice. <laughs> I'm imagining Pikachu is like the village elder here. All right, I got their other Pokemon now. I'm just going to call up Pete. This sucks. I'm not even gonna be creative. Oh, the nurse gave me a, a treasure chest. I'm not laughing at that. I'm just laughing at the general world. Because I was gonna say, why is there blood on the nurse? But then I realized there's blood all over the trees for some reason. Oh god, I opened the chest of videos inside. Do I really want to see this? It's gonna be feckin' brutal. Right, just watch it. Okay, it's just black and white footage of sad animals. Honestly, if I was searching for treasure and I found that, I'd be... I'd be pretty disappointed, to be honest with you. Oh my god, it's the heroin addict from the artwork of the game. Look at it. I'm gonna protest the heroin. <laughs> Pikachu beat down on Professor Juniper with some powerful words. Oh, now Pikachu is going up on his high horse again. <laughs> Pokemon are not yours to experiment on, Professor. <laughs> okay. All right, since this Pokemon came with a needle already stuck in their head, I'm just calling them addict. Oh, another treasure chest. Peter Sucks says, I hope it doesn't have another sad video in it. The Mud Kip inside gives you a Pokemon black and blue desktop wallpaper. Am I even brave enough to click this? Alright, what what is it? No, no thanks. I I, I don't want that at all. It's so low rest and everything. Oh my god, what the hell is this thing? It's got a coat made out of Pokemon skin. <laughs> like Pokemon abuse aside, I think this guy's just a serial killer. Which is why I hugged him. Big fan. <laughs> Send in addict. <laughs> Where's the ability to throw use needle? Okay, I'm just getting another Pokemon. I don't even understand where they came from. Unwanted will be your name. Oh, another treasure chest. What's in it this time? A set of trading cards. Oh look, there's the heroin addict again. Hey, you want to trade your Mr. Mime for my shiny heroin addict. <laughs> oh my god, what? This is Ash? What happened to you? <laughs> Feckin' hell, he mixed in with the wrong crowd and now look at him. And how is Pikachu alive? Pikachu is actually dead. I mean, I guess it is nice to see Ash actually growing up. There's finally some progression there. That's that's some development. Okay, I, I, I beat him. All right, we've we've done it. <laughs> this was just a roller coaster from start to finish. Share video? <laughs> no thanks. But you, you, you share video. Please, share my videos. <laughs> Alright, that game wasn't amazing. Honestly, if, if I want to be brutally honest and give that a review, I would have to lower it to 9.8 out of 10, I think. Which is disappointing, but I have faith in our next one. Now we're going to be playing new Super Chick Sisters. I didn't even know there was an old <laughs> Super Chick Sisters. Oh god damn it, I can only be Nugget or Chickette. I can't be Pamela Anderson because she is locked. You know, Peter, 
I'm disappointed in you. I didn't think it was possible to be any more disappointed in Peter, but this game is lazy and you've really missed the mark on this one. I expected better from a game that's logo was literally the McDonald's logo with a line through it. Hey, Peter, I'm giving you a one. <laughs> this game's awful. I'm demanding a refund for that game. I didn't pay anything for it, but I did pay with my time. Unfortunately, my time doesn't have much value. God damn it, it th this one's so small. <laughs> super Tofu Boy is also super small. I. You can download the game, but I don't really want to run a PETA EXE on my computer. I don't- for some reason, I don't believe PETA to be the most trustworthy people. Tip, not only is Tofu Boy sexy, he tastes good too. Is that a tip? <laughs> I don't think that is a tip, you know. Oh my god, that kind of scared me for some reason. This is too violent for me. I do not endorse this cruelty against this tofu, PETA. This, this game's getting actually kind of hard. Oh, there's McDonald's again. God, they really love marketing McDonald's. Must have sponsored the game or something. Oh, I could go for a McTofu right about now. You know what? I could go for a different feckin' game. <laughs> ah, yes. The next Cooking Mama game. Cooking Mama. Mama kills animals. Honestly, that is a good representation of what she is actually like. She's terrifying. All right, make it Thanksgiving feast. Prepare the turkey. What kind of cookbook is this? The writing is going off the page. There we go. It's still better than the recent Cooking Mama that came out. Shrek fries it is. There you go. Why is there a night vision filter? <laughs> Sam Fisher eating fries, POV. Meaner than Mama. I don't know about that. <laughs> Look at you. Remove the internal organs. I'm playing a mix of Cooking Mama and Surgeon Sim now. Oh, this organ fell down. There we go. <laughs> Complete. That's our meal? Are we serving it up like that? It's gonna be a bad thing. Thanksgiving. Oh, cracking eggs. Okay, the best part of cooking. Here's some eggs I made earlier. We've got 12 of them. It's been a busy morning. And then we'll just add three of them. Why is there blood coming out of the egg? What the hell? Why is there blood and everything in the, their games? Even on the trees. Ah, oh, classic blood tree. Okay, what are we doing now? Okay, this part seems pretty innocent, except for the, the blood eggs over here. Okay, why is this turkey Harry Potter all of a sudden? Good lord, this is the gravy? Uh, must have been store brand. <laughs> all right, there's our meal, ready to go. Eat up, everyone. <laughs> Remember to say what you're thankful for. Thanks to you, Mama has had a change of her. <laughs> she was the one egging me on this whole time. Wonderful. It doesn't mama. All right, on to our very last PETA game. Thank God. <laughs> I have more reasons to hate Peter than ever now. When on a mission to rescue the princess, Mario has been known to use any means necessary to defeat his enemy, even wearing the skin of a raccoon dog to give him special powers. Mario is sending the message that it's okay to wear fur. Okay, <laughs> I guess I gotta stop him. This game is hard. I don't think I can actually catch him. Oh, now I see where there's blood everywhere. You see all this blood-stained grass? Well, it was feckin' Mario all the time. He's dripping blood everywhere. That explains the trees and everything. It proves that every PETA game is in the same universe. It's like a PETA cinematic universe. God, that's a depressing thought. Oh, no. God, oh my god, oh my god. This game is stressing me out. It's way too hard. <sighs> Oh, God, this is harder than the original Mario. <laughs> like, way harder. Good lord, the likes to dislikes on the trailer for this game. Look, I think we can all agree with no one wants to see cruelty against animals, but I think PETA, as an organization, from what I've seen, is questionable at best. And a big question I have for you, PETA, is why the hell did you make these games? Oh, God. God, <laughs> oh, I'm gonna have to work on repressing these all uh, and I, I have so much to repress already. It's adding it to a big list. My brother is dead. What is happening to Kevin? Nobody wanted to get their hands on Jude's bull semen. Don't, don't, please. <laughs> Wonderful. Come on, little lesbian. What? Oh. I just want to see the side the winners and by the... But I think we're gonna leave it there. To summarize, I don't like video games anymore. But I think we're gonna leave it there. There's only so much horrible video games I can take in one day. <laughs> but I do hope you enjoyed the video. If you wanna check out these games, then what the hell is wrong with you? Please change your mind, I beg of you. <laughs> I thank you very much for checking out my video though. I appreciate that. If you wanna see more of me, I post every single day and I also stream over on Twitch. The link for that is in the description. But uh, yeah, I won't ramble on too much more. I uh, hope you enjoy your day. 
Hope you enjoyed the video, and I hope to see you next time. I'm open for a lot of things. All right, I'll leave it there. Bye for now. Shout out to Patreons Brooke Schuler, Calicus Jinx, Call Me Keevan, Candy, Captain Clown Show, Carissa, Carrie Berg, Casey Baltez, Kashui, Cat Celesti, Charlie's 22, Charlie Prudames, Chase Does Stuff, Chase Bragg, Chelsea Peterson, Chair Sandals, Chrissy Jones, Cinnabuddy, Corbin Nutson, Crosshaven Entertainment, Crow, Dagmar Makara, Damon Trilogy, Dakota Wing, Dandelion Ellie, Dane Resuggan, Daniel Corlett, Daniel O'Neill, Dennis Bosky, Divine Coconut, DJ Crispy Smooth, and Dora B.